this volcanic eruption happened in 2017. The whole island shook. It was an early Sunday morning. We looked up at the top of the mountain. We saw this thick smoke coming out and then we smell this gas. We had this earthquake every now and then. For me, personally, all this came into my head. I lost my husband. I only have these two little kids with me and I'm like, oh, what's the next thing? We went together in the Nakamal, the meeting place. The chief called everybody together. We have to pack our clothes. You are not going to get the whole suitcase. One bag for each person. If you have uh, hats, you wear your hat on. If you don't have hats, you tie up this calico around your head. Touch light. You don't have light at all, then maybe you can light up the candle and see. And then you move around. Because there's this thick sand falling from the sky. Not long, we had this siren from the police truck coming. And so this police came up and they told us, we have five hours to catch your things and then we will move to the safe zone. So where we come from, we have to cross dry creeks. All of us were scared, like if there is hot lava, it will come down uh, the creek and then where are we going to go to? Like, all I knew is, if this explosion gets worse and it breaks up the island, I will die with my children. Lord, this is beyond what I can think of. Whatever the next step is, it's all in your hands.